Welcome to Egg Yield's National Database – How to Enter Grain Yield with Multiple Dates In this example, we will enter several years of barley grain yields from a published dataset. The reference details have been entered, and the site details have also been entered. There are other tutorials that show you how to enter the reference and site details. Now, click on Add an Experiment and give the experiment a name. Select the measurement type and the unit. The data refers to a sown barley crop, so that sown species option is selected. Enter the number of measurements, which represents the number of data rows that will be entered. In this case, there are 29 measurement dates. Because it is a crop, grain yield values can be inserted. Select Yes to insert grain yield data. Nutrient and irrigation treatments can be entered in this next step. There are no treatments in this example, so we'll leave the boxes unchecked. Click Save. The grid is created for the user to enter the measurement dates, the dry matter yield and grain yield. Type or simply copy and paste the values into the grid. When transferring the values, check that the yield units match. In this case, there are only grain yield values to be entered. Save the data. To check the entry as a CSV output, go back to the dashboard. Click on the download icon. Open the CSV file to review the data entered. Go back to the dashboard to continue in the data entry mode or save the output CSV file on your computer.